This example will go through the steps in balancing an equation for the combustion of a hydrocarbon with 26 carbon atoms. The compound C26H54 is one of the hydrocarbon compounds found in paraffin wax. It is called hexacosane. We're asked to balance this equation, the combustion of hexacosane in oxygen, using the lowest possible set of whole number coefficients. For equations with carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen in them, it's always best to balance them in the order C first, then H, and then O last. So we'll start with C. There are 26 carbons on the left side. And since CO2 has one carbon atom, we'll write 26 here. So there are now 26 carbons on the right side. So carbon atoms are balanced. Next, we'll balance hydrogen. There are 54 hydrogens on the left side. And because a water molecule has two hydrogen atoms, we write a 27 in here. 2 times 27 is 54, so we have 54 hydrogens on the right side. So hydrogen atoms are now balanced. Now we'll balance the oxygen atoms. There are 2 times 26, or 52 oxygens in the CO2, and 1 times 27, or 27 oxygens in the water. So we have a total of 52 plus 27 equals 79 oxygens on the right side. So we need 79 oxygens on the left side to balance the oxygens. Since there's a 2 in the O2, we write a coefficient 79 over 2 in front of the O2, because 2 times 79 over 2 is equal to 79. So now we have 79 oxygens on both sides. So the equation is now balanced. However, we are asked to balance the equation using the lowest possible set of whole number coefficients, and 79 over 2 is a fraction, not a whole number. You can see that multiplying 79 over 2 times 2 and cancelling out the 2's gives us 79, which is a whole number. But to keep the equation balanced, if we multiply 79 over 2 times 2, then we must multiply all the coefficients by 2. This gives us the set of coefficients 2, 79, 52, and 54. We can now replace the coefficients we had in the equation by these, which gives us this set of whole number coefficients. Note that there is nothing we can divide all the coefficients by and still come out with all whole numbers. So this is the lowest possible set of whole number coefficients that will balance this equation. Now we'll do a quick count of atoms to make sure this equation is balanced. We have 26 times 2, or 52 carbon atoms on the left. And 1 times 52 equals 52 carbon atoms on the right. So carbons are balanced. We have 54 times 2 equals 108 hydrogens on the left. And 2 times 54 equals 108 hydrogens on the right. So hydrogens are balanced. We have 2 times 79 equals 158 oxygens on the left side. Looking on the right side, we have 2 times 52 equals 104 oxygens in the CO2. And 1 times 54 equals 54 oxygens in the water. So the total number of oxygens on the right is 104 plus 54, which equals 158 oxygen atoms. Since there are 158 oxygens on both sides, oxygen atoms are also balanced. So we end by stating that this is the correct balanced equation for the combustion of hexacosane.